Sometimes the hardest thing is for someone to come through the front door. Often it's as simple as coming into a room once a week and being around other people that can make all the difference. They just need to talk to somebody who is independent, but who will listen and will hear the challenges and the difficulties that they're facing and be caring and be understanding. It does help just to be able to say what you're feeling and no one judges you or says anything about it. We're here basically to try and ensure that no one has to suffer a mental health problem alone or suffer because of lack of advice and support. Being able to watch someone come in who is really struggling and see their journey and how it can be helped by just being around other people that are experiencing the same thing. I think that's one of the most powerful things. They've helped me to become a bit more confident, to go down different routes with taking my children out and be looking at job opportunities, just general support. West Kent Mind has helped me in more ways than I can possibly say. From the day I walked into the centre, they've offered me support, understanding, kindness. The biggest change in my life since finding Mind has been my art. Um, I've gone from never having painted at all to being on the second year of a fine art degree in the space of three years, something which would never have happened without the facilities and the support offered by West Kent Mind. People who are experiencing a mental health problem think that they are on their own. You are not on your own and you don't have to be on your own. Nine out of ten people experiencing a mental health problem face stigma and discrimination. The greatest cause of death among men under 35 is suicide. Right now, one in six British workers are experiencing depression, stress or anxiety. About three children in every classroom have a diagnosable mental health problem and one in four people in any given year could suffer from a mental health condition. That means about 380,000 people in Kent could be affected by this at some point in their life. And that's where West Kent Mind can help. What we do is find ways of reducing stigma, decreasing the bad name mental health actually has, and ensure that we offer a service to the local community and wider within West Kent. When the role at West Kent Mind came up, it was finally a chance to really go where my heart is, supporting people who sometimes are judged and sometimes treated unfairly, but are suffering a problem that one in four of us will experience and deserve all the help and support they can get. And that's what West Kent Mind is really all about. West Kent Mind is a charity that relies heavily on donations and volunteering to help it survive. People just like you are raising money right now or giving their time and skills to help tackle mental health problems in West Kent. So get involved, maybe try volunteering or use your expertise to train or teach one of our groups. Perhaps you could organise a fundraising event or just make a donation. I just want to say an absolutely huge thank you to anyone that has supported us so far because without that support we probably still wouldn't be here. However you'd like to help, please do get in touch at westkentmind.org.uk or call 01732 744 950. Thank you.